So I painted this, what vaguely resembles a tiny little beach and a water scene with the little sun. And I couldn't believe it because this hand who, that hasn't worked in 20 years, um, I devised, it was like Inspector Gadget. It was like, and that was it, I was done. I'm Arlene Weber and I'm an artist. All right. Thinking that do this one and this one. I make my own tools to suit what I need to do. So I started making these paintings as a means of rehabilitation to get my hand moving again, range of motion. Um, because I'm limited with the fine motor skills, I consider myself to be differently abled. Not disabled, um, not exceptional, just differently abled. So when I write and when I do things, it's apparently very different from other people. So. I was young. I was in my 30s. I woke up with a headache. Um, and then basically stumbled. I just stumbled, something was completely off. It's a small blood vessel, the vein that works its way up and it bursts inside of the brain. And it was so minute, but just enough to cause enough damage to where my hand was affected the worst. Oh, the damn brush. Look, this happens all the time, I hate it. After I had my initial small stroke, I developed uh, dystonia, which is distinctively different. Dystonia is a neurological movement disorder, so it's not anything that heals over time. If anything, it tends to get worse. With mine, it plateaued, and it's been like this for 20 years. Okay. I refuse to look at pictures for two reasons. One, a photograph could have taken that photographer hours to get the right shot, to sit at that one moment to get that sunrise. And I can't steal that image. That's their moment. And the second reason is, it's very unlikely that I'd get it exactly the same and that frustrates me. I will admit, I don't like to use big boards. To me, this is a bigger board because it tends to be easier for me. And the whole point of me painting is to get that exercise in my hand. Sometimes it never turns out the way I'd hoped. And other times I have a lot of pictures of rocks. And that's, <laughs> especially when I started, it's like, ooh, another rock picture. Wouldn't throw it out, but darn it all, we'd have another rock picture. <laughs> Can you imagine after all of the different pictures, still the hardest thing is my simple signature. I'm hoping that my paintings would empower someone to say, I'm gonna challenge myself. If she can do it, I can do it. Okay, we're off to make a delivery to a little store called the Maker's Keep, where they're selling my paintings. So last week I had nine pictures. Now I have two. Yay! Okay. Ooh, had a little moment. You know when you try something and you think, well, I, I'm not expecting, but you're hoping people would like it? And then when it actually pans out that people are liking it? Unless we've got a high theft problem here. Do you think we have a high theft Disability, <laughs> something taken away, to me is just a negative term. So I'm hoping that that word eventually in the, this new generation of people is completely changed. Different abilities, yes. All of us do things differently and at different rates. We learn different, um, we adapt differently, that life is about change. And as far as what we can achieve, sky's the limit.